Yep, that's uh, the kind of reaction you're going to get just for one small mistake here because it really does make a huge difference. Everyone will probably finish in the, those who are in the top ten within just a couple of tenths of each other. It's that kind of a track. You have a lot of tight finishes as Zandra Robacha from Italy takes to the hill. Cracking start from Robacha. Oh, well, that's already slipped. In comparison to Martina Cocker, who still leads the race. Oh, my goodness! Flipped into the corner. And if she can hang on to sled and pop back on again, she could yet finish this run. But I think she might have hurt herself a bit, actually. As she comes down into the Kreisel. And uh, as it comes back uphill there, she'll just stop in the belly of Kreisel. And, uh, well, let's just hope she's all right. There's a funny old crash, that. Just coming in too late into the corner and, and flipped into it. The pressure can do uh, strange things. It just uh, didn't really look too much there. It looked like she'd got it terribly wrong. Perhaps uh, we'll have another look here. And the junior start on the right there. Uh, in fact, she actually, <laughs> what an odd crash that is. Corner eight, end of the Amiga. And uh, she was up and on. The finishing starts very, very early there. Uh, and somehow she managed to flip inwards. I'd really like to see that again. It was just an odd way to crash. Very odd indeed. And in some ways, when you get onto the filleting that early, you're normally kicked away and kicked off the corner. And I, I'm guessing she was steering like mad to stay on the corner, and it just flipped her over. Anyway, thumbs up. She's okay. Well, we may yet have a track hold.